like next Monday is the return of MSM offline. But like, All right, I was so like, let me just say that's BS. Um, yes, we're, it's, we're not, it's not. A, we're, we're streaming. Uh, Wait, you know something I don't know? We're streaming a charity event on Monday during the time uh-huh. that MSM usually is. I was going to say, Zifa, so, you should know this. I, I did know. I did so, know. Yeah. It's $10 yeah. in there and it's for uh, Black Lives Matter. So yep. if, you're, if you care about that, you should enter. You should probably have a command for that in the chat. Yeah, yeah we're all, team, proceeds, we have all, all proceeds will go to the Black Lives Matter movement. It's next Monday, but unfortunately, yeah, there's no MSM offline. Like, just like Straight no. says, don't expect to be don't, don't, don't worry about it. We'll, you'll yeah. know when you're offline. The whole world will know when people can go offline. I do Back know in Africa. Vegas, <laughs> they're allowing some tournaments. Okay. Yeah. That's Vegas. Uh, that's all I'm gonna say. I'm gonna make that four hour drive, boys. No, I'm kidding. For a local? You would. I would not. I would you not. would. I do, I do. I do do that. I'll have to admit, like, picking up the 818, getting into MSM, sure feels like four hours, man. <laughs> it really does, but. Um, a choice of my own that I have to make to do it? No. I'm sorry. I don't want to go four hours for just a local. Unless the I'm only staying way there for I like a day or two. That making sense is it. A- the locals have a super limited cap of people that can show up, like 30 people or something silly. I think that's what I heard from Game Nest. Game Nest is like one of the main locals at, uh, at Vegas, and from what I saw on their official Twitter page, you know, they're going to allow a set, there's, there's a cap, like a very strict cap, and that doesn't mean that like, we can only have this many entrants, it means we can only have this many people, and sorry, you cannot come in. Guy, yeah. if we have MSM offline, are you even gonna come? Did you come before? He shows up. Yeah, he did. Yeah, he did. He did. All right. He, sh- he, sh- he shows up to MSM and WNF. He's what? No, he doesn't. Yeah, I've he been at every him. MSM. Or not no, at MSM. W- every at WNF. He he's been to at least one or two WNFs. I swear uh. he's been to at least one or two. I know. I know. I know you. I know you're like at every WNF. But <laughs> I know I've seen Gale at one or two WNFs for sure. Like, so I've seen uh, Web JP a lot, but I don't know who uh, Monty is. I guess they're good to so we are sitting with us and they're playing Game Watch. I think Monty is actually a local. Oh, if I remember correctly. Yeah, he's from Pico Rivera. That's cool. I, mean, I always want to see. SoCal people actually win in the same. It doesn't happen though. It doesn't. Oh, that's not Oh, that was pretty aggressive to come out there with Bucket from the ledge. I mean, it would have been a good call out against WebJP just because of how he was playing at the ledge, but like, I thought that was a little bit too telegraphed. And the one thing that like Lucas can do at the ledge is just space at the ledge really well too, so, I mean. Yeah, yeah this match was kind of interesting because, like, on paper, you would think Game Watch does alright, but he kind of just can't really get in on Lucas. I don't know, I feel like Lucas' hitbox is just better. Well, having a character that, like, fast or is not move that pushes back. Yeah. Yeah. Like, I know Lucas will get juggled, but starting those juggles is too not easy. This is a really bad recovery situation over. I think Lucas can come back from this. Yeah, yeah. I'm surprised that we didn't see WebJP like charging the down smash as soon as PK Thunder came out. I think it was hit put for Zare, but good downer out of shields gets a nice little combo, 55. I mean, he's still got a stock lead, so WebJP doesn't have to worry too much. Yeah, if he wants, he can just like hang back, space Zare, do some PK fires. Man, it sounds like a life. Hang back, Zare, PK fire. Yeah, this. If he keeps getting that down there, the ground bounce one, uh, you just get destroyed. <laughs> it actually, it's actually really good. Oh, oh he missed his up throw. Yeah, I think up throw kills him. Watch it. Even without rage. Without rage. Yeah. yeah. Ooh, like I said, oh, oh my god. 
Watch Game and Watch is still a top 10 line character. He's not that heavy. And in hyper sense, he dies to a lot of things. He can even die in like I think I've seen him die as early as like 40. Well, looks like Wave JP is trying to close out the game with PK fires. We've seen him uh, land PK fire to snipe out games uh, quite a bit. Ooh, nice catch! The, nice catch! Bracket. Yeah, it also helps that uh, Lucas has quite a few kill moves too to deal with. You know, game watches lightweight. It's actually pretty cool to see an actual good Lucas. Or Buffer from Mars, man. He's somewhere out there watching the VOD. Do like damn strides. That hurt. I don't even watch Muffin play in this game ever. Because I don't ever watch Hat. So I don't, have not seen him play at all. But you knew he was at Hat. You knew that oh. much. Oh. Well, I rested my yeah. kids. I rested my kids. What? <laughs> Why would I just assume that he's good? If I've never seen him play. Anyway. Ready? Okay, jumping into game two. Let's see. Ooh, bigger stage. Three, two, one, go! Mm. I'm uh, I don't know. I don't like big stages. I think Lou is a really good zoning character. Ironically, when you look at Web JP's tag. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, that's why I, I don't know. I don't like to take Lucas to big stages because it's so difficult to get in on him when he's facing PA fire. And uh, yeah. he has pretty good combos too. That like oh there it is. <laughs> Yeah, down double air. down air <laughs> to grab. That's oh, is that uh -oh. me? Is that us? No, oh. I think the oh. game is stuttering. Oh no! I hate to see it happen. I feel like this happens at least once every time. Four times. I know WebJP was having connection uh, issues a little bit earlier, so I'm hoping that's not it. Throw. Oh, oh, forward throw, the mix up. Right, you, know, you know something I don't. Probably the high ceiling, which uh, wouldn't have killed. Oh, I, mean, I just would have gone for it because I like game watches, honestly. It's close to me. Oh, yeah. That, that directional air dodge off stage is a killer. You know, like, Lucas is recovery, but who cares? I'm just <laughs> zapping with this PK fire. I'm telling you, quick. man, he's he's so smooth with those snipes. Yeah, it's like the strong, fifth man. or sixth stock I've seen him take with side B. It's, it's like pretty good kill move, especially if they're deep off stage. Oh my gosh, I forgot about PK freeze. That move is criminal. <laughs> freeze. <laughs> oh. Oh yeah, and his sweet spot fair is disgusting too. PK, PK Freeze is one of the most criminal moves Lucas has. So you're telling me all of Lucas' specials can kill? And his aerial yeah. can kill? <laughs> yes. Uh, yeah. Huh. He was pretty underrated, man. He was, oh. under, he was underrated in 4. Yeah. I think a lot of people in this game were just like, oh, he doesn't have his uh, down throw combos or whatever. Has four, so he's not as good. But slowly but surely, the Lucas players are like figuring out how to make him work in this game. I feel like that that's when we kind recovery. of follow characters, like like you said with Sonic, right? I think Game Watch is another one of those characters. We kind of just like said, like, oh, this character sucks. They changed yeah. his forward air, and the next thing we know, we start complaining about this character within like six months. Wow, yes. they hit below the stage. WebJP yeah. goes up 2 0. Yeah, Web, Web JP is playing amazing. Nothing else, nothing else to say really. <laughs> and I think the matchup is hard for Game Watch. Like, he's just gonna use the bucket on the projectiles, right? But that doesn't really stop Lucas's from spacing him out with the specials to begin with. 
you know. Is Lucas's neutral trash? Mm. I, I can't Versus agree with that. Grizz is some characters, maybe. Rush downs, maybe? Yeah, Grizz characters, I can... Um, I don't think it's trash. And, like, you know, put him in disadvantage, because disadvantage is pretty terrible. But if you can't get in on him, he's very good, <laughs> in my opinion. I don't think he's... I don't think he's easy to approach with a lot of people. But we'll see. Yeah, I don't think it's just trash. I just think it's not as good as other characters, but I don't think it's trash. Yeah. Sounds like trash. He has a lot, he has a lot of options. Surprising. Oh. Oh. Uh-oh. Nah, nah, Lucas is a... Oh, no. no. He thought his... He thought his zero connect to the edge. Well... Did he just zero death him with neutral B pretty much? Yep. That's what feels bad. But that's good for Monty. Like the best thing he's had. He's, he's running away with it now. This is the, the Game and Watch special. This is also incredibly good versus Lucas because he really didn't have that many good ways to land. All of his yeah. areas are laggy. Speaking about getting in, Monty just continues to dash attack and nair his way closer to Web JP and then up B and here comes Juggles. Yeah. He was like, bro, I got that zero death. I'm gonna run away with it man. Not even gonna give you time to set up anymore. Which is what he should have been doing. But he just never found himself in a <laughs> position to do that. Yeah. Lucas up he comes from the bottom of the blast zone. I, I never think nice. I'm gonna I never think Lucas is, isn't gonna make it back. Oh yeah, we're just struggling a lot right now. He's Game Watch isn't even close to kill this thing yet either. Oh deep. Deep back there. That's exactly what you want. Especially if your opponent doesn't have a double jump. Oh, this this uh, might be curtains. I don't know. It's just one three game, though. Three spark lead, yeah. But that's a lot of momentum that Montan could definitely yeah. be in, and then also start to understand how WebJP plays. It's like this this game could be could be crucial. We'll have to see the next game. I mean, I don't want to write write off WebJP just yet, but. I yeah. mean, this lead is looking pretty significant. Yeah, and, you know, Monty has not really uh, dropped momentum in you know, quite some time. Honestly, he doesn't seem so confident. <laughs> oh. Oh, that he could have actually totally screwed over on JP on the recovery. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. He's like, all right, man, you started to charge us smash the neutral. All right, I'm just going to use this tether. <laughs> Okay, you know what? Red well, JP actually did get reverse three stock last time versus Tony, so maybe this guy, maybe this guy can do it. Man. Yeah, I mean he stopped he stopped the three stock, so I mean. Oh, he's crazy. Yeah, he is. But I mean that would have been so great if it worked. <laughs> yeah. Oh. Oh, right, it's I, nice I, I, I thought he was gonna go for back throw for stage control. Yeah. Instead of an edge guard there, but I, I. Maybe he wants to. Either from scaling, I don't know. Even if he doesn't uh, scale, I think back throw would have been the better play. <laughs> Unless you're going for a four throw combo, but I've never heard of Lucas having one. So. Hold up, Monty's kind of throwing this one away. <laughs> oh snap! Yeah. Yeah. This, this comeback looks like mighty back. real. Where'd they, where'd they, Right yeah, this is... Ooh. Ooh. Yo, he didn't care about the up smash, he just ran right into him. No right. fear. He lost there. Ooh, close. Oh, he saved his goal again. No! Doesn't matter, bro. <laughs> That's so sad. <laughs> He's like, I'm gonna, I'm gonna have the most intelligent recovery. I'll, I'll, I'm not gonna commit to my double jump. I'm gonna stall as long as possible. And Monty's just like, I'm just gonna keep back air over and over. Like, I don't, I really, I don't care what you're trying to do. The wall like, of back airs. Back air is gonna hit at some point. <laughs> That's all he knew. That was actually a really good comeback, though. I, I actually thought he was gonna win that. <laughs> After he took the second stop.
Yeah, you guys in chat are right, man. Let's just legalize Lila. Mm -hmm. Oh, greater, 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 greater. What, are, what are you doing? 2020 is already pretty bad six months in, man. I don't think we want another bad legal stage to, to make no, it No, we're not going to change the stage, Luke. If you guys don't like it, just don't aim it. Sorry. Like, it's, just, it's been the SoCal innocent stage list since this game came out. Anyway. I was kind of hoping. Sorry, I mean, just to like add to that, I was kind of hoping we were gonna do like. I thought it'd be a cool idea because you know other games do it, but I know fighting games isn't do, but I feel like you can do it with Smash. I thought it would have been nice to have like a legal, like a seasonal legal stage list. I thought it would have been nice, but clearly why? Yeah, that sounds why that very complex, and uh, a lot of people don't really want to put in that much effort to do something like that. Yeah. I mean, that, there's a reason why they didn't exist, but that was just my idea. Makes sense. Oh, oh no. Okay, the edge guards are starting to come out now. I think that's, uh, that's what Monty was struggling with before. Okay, so now uh, Web's trying to like space with aerials, but every time he tries to like commit to double jump aerial, he gets intercepted by game watching there, and one game watching there leads to another one. Much. Yeah, uh, this is this is hard. Oh. Oh, and he got two from two. Oh man, yeah. I don't know what happened between this uh, third game and now, but yeah, Monty is going going crazy. He's had time to adapt and also understanding like what JP on the receiving end, like he understands like oh Lucas really hurts when his when he's in his disadvantage, <laughs> especially from last yeah. game. Yeah, I actually think this is uh like. You know, FD pretty good for like owning, but once Lucas has nowhere to land, it's actually really good for game watch, I think. No platforms to retreat to, you know? Yeah. Nowhere to run, nowhere to hide. Nice. That was clean. I have, I've never seen it, but that was clean. <laughs> Sometimes you gotta work with what you have. Bless you. Go for the back throw. Oh, PK oh. Freeze coming out. I just love that move because even if you don't really commit to using it, just using it is enough to force your opponent to pick an option. Yeah, yeah. dude. If you get hit by it, you just get yeeted to the blast zone. <laughs> <laughs> this yeah. doesn't even freeze you in place. Like you, you actually get frozen, and then you go towards the blast zone. You don't go yeah. anywhere else but the blast zone. It's actually really scary. I think you have to have like super good mash to not die. If you have like, to be uh, elegant or West Balls. Basically, or Nairo. Yeah, what are, yeah, what are the three? Nairo, yeah. All right, so once again, Web JP finds himself in just when he can uh, make a comeback happen. Not too far behind. He's barely avoiding these down smashes. Dude, yeah. how did he do a neutral get up and not get hit by down smash? I don't, he's, I don't I, know. He just knows. He knows does not me. respect that move. He has no fear. Oh. 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 oh, oh Step on oh. him. I thought he would have smashed Same. I thought he would have, but I feel like he was cut in the Nah, man. Too much wind up. Just get this 2D character out of here. Back throw. Yeah, get him out of here. Up throw will kill. Up throw will kill. He literally needs a grab, a smash attack, and then he sneezes on this paper character and it's over. I feel like Montian was oh, at 0% a few seconds ago. Yeah. Good comeback. Good comeback. Man, that was actually really good for uh, both players, honestly. Monty started to figure things out, it made it really difficult for uh, WebJP. But uh, OGV, you know, got himself back in the game. Pulled out some crazy stuff.
And uh, now he's in winner's finals. Uh, can't remember how this went last time. I know Tony won, but I don't remember if it was a close set or not. I just remember he, that uh, Web JP got like really good reverse three stock. Apparently, this is a hard matchup for Lucas. I think it's pretty I hard. Could imagine. I mean, we were talking earlier about how Lucas was struggling once a character gets in, and Sonic, being the best character in the game, has an easy time maneuvering around the projectiles. So this is just yeah. the rushdown game, really. Yeah, it's kind of funny how, like, SB's like suggestion, can Yoshi's be added to the stage list? I feel like we could have added it, uh, but the no. biggest problem. No, no. The biggest problem no. is that we already have Battlefield. <laughs> I don't know. These other I games don't care. I don't know Yoshi what this logic is. Yoshi's Story. Or I think it's Yoshi's Island, which is the one that's Battlefield. Sorry. Yeah. Yoshi's Story. Story. Yeah, Yoshi's Story. Is... Horrible stage. Yeah. I don't think it's that I think, bad. I just think you it's... Know, oh, well. These, these guys you don't live... on it enough. These guys don't live with Zinyu and Master Mario. Oh, that's <laughs> fair. That is actually fair. I totally forgot that. That's why. Yeah. They, that's why they want these things. Mario's really? on that stage are not okay. <laughs> you guys I weren't remember, you, you, like watching Stroder play. People and, weren't like, my region. Lost his name, and then he just went pocket Mario and Yoshi, and he three stocked this person, and he didn't like, even for, made Mario. I'm not gonna lie. Like I actually tell people, if it wasn't for Nico in Smash Ultimate coming 